Hey guys, it's Steve with No Prep Fam. Welcome to Tucson Dragway in Tucson, Arizona. We are back here and it is beautiful as ever. Um, it's a little bit overcast today. It is a dry heat and I absolutely love it. I'm used to that <laughs> humidity from down in Mississippi now. But anyways, uh, the weather is gonna be a little bit shaky, uh, just to let y'all know. Um, there is a slight chance of rain uh, this afternoon between like three and six, um, but then it does clear up after that. So obviously we have uh, grudge racing and the great eight tonight. Um, but we also have the invitational tomorrow. And again, there's a slight chance of rain. So just be looking out for that. Just want y'all to be aware what's going on um, I'm out here on the track. It's absolutely awesome. It's slick as could be. Uh, it's gonna be tricky for these guys to get down tonight, that's for sure. We'll see how it comes around for tomorrow. But y'all know what time it is. It's time for your pit tour. Today I'm riding my TT750R. You know why. This is brought to you by Burlmax. Alright guys, let's start out your pit tour with your points leader, Ryan Martin. He's got 460 points currently. He is up 120 points on second place, Kai Kelly. Let's see if uh, Ryan can pull up another win here. Uh, he is your last week's winner at Firebird Raceway. Speaking of P2, here is Kai Kelly from Team NOLA and his new NPK Shocker. Uh, it's been a little bit of a rough start. Uh, obviously, you got that new car blues going on right now, but I uh, know he's been testing and uh, he'll get this car figured out. Currently, he is 100 points up on third place, which is a tie between Lizzie Musi and Justin Swanstrom. Here is P3, Lizzie, Musi, and Bonnie. Uh, had a rough week last week. Went out first round in Firebird Raceway versus uh, Brandon James, who actually went to the semifinals. So we'll see if uh, Lizzie can bounce back. Uh, currently, like I said, she's tied with Justin Swanstrom in prenup for this third position. All right, guys, here is Justin Swanstrom in prenup. This lime green Lexus tied for third in points with Lizzie Musi 10 points up on fifth place. This screw blower has been awesome for this team. Last week he went out third round versus Bodie Jr. in a close, close race. But these guys have been rolling. This lime green has been good for old Swan Gang. Here is Scott Taylor, track doe. He's in that P5 position. Had a really good week. His best performance of the season last week. Went to the finals versus Ryan Martin. Uh, Y'all seen he made an announcement this week. He's working with Proline. Does not look like he's got that motor in just yet. Um, but I'm sure he's working on getting that thing in as soon as possible. He is fifth in points and up 10 points on sixth place. Looking to move up this week, Tucson Dragway. Here is P6 Jerry Bird and his probe. Got this nitrous powered buck racing engine. Nitrous power, ready to roll up here in this high altitude. He is up 20 points on second place see how Jerry can do this weekend in Tucson. Alright guys, here is P7. Dave Comstock. Goliath. Had a rough week last week. Ended up having uh, some, some motor problems that prevented him from making the race last week. You know, dropping down to 7th place. Uh, but looks like everything is a go for this week with Goliath. Looking to move back up this list. Alright guys, here is one of your 8th place drivers, that is J. 
Jeff Lutz. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. He is currently tied eighth place with Robin Roberts. Uh, had a rough week last week. Went out first round versus Mike Morello at Firebird, but we're at a new track this week. Let's see if Junior and Jeff can figure this out. Good luck, guys. Thank you, buddy. guys here is Robin Roberts in his brand new car high velocity he is in that bubble position tied with Jeff Lutz uh, as far as I know they are going to be doing a coin flip to decide if Jeff or Robin will be the eighth driver in that grade eight tonight uh, Robin uh, went out second round last week versus Jim Howe, so we'll see if this team can improve on that. All right, guys, here is Team Cali. Here's Bodie. Corrupt. Beautiful, beautiful car here. Twin turbo power. Next door, we got Bodie Jr.'s Pro Charge Camaro. Flying last week. Came up just a half a car short. Semi-finals last week, Scott Taylor. But this team is rolling. Here's another member of Team Cali. This is Mike Bowman, his brand new Chevelle. Uh, he is currently tied for 13th place. 40 points back of the grade eight. This Pro Charger setup has been awesome for this team. Last year he switched mid-season from twin turbo, if you remember. Right next door is one of your semi-finalists from last week, along with uh, Team Bodie, Team or Team Cali teammate Bodie Jr. This is Brandon James. First time in the semifinals in NPK, so awesome weekend for him. See if he can build on that this week, Tucson Dragway. Another Team Cali member, James Strang. Come on over here. <laughs> team Cali's here to represent the West Coast this weekend. Sure. We don't get a whole lot of West Coast races. Mm -hmm. So, you know, there's five of us here this weekend. Typically there's only two, three, you right. know, we're real spotty, but we got the whole team here this weekend. That's good. So we're super excited to come out here and represent the West Coast like we Absolutely. need to. Absolutely. That's awesome. How far are we from home for you? Uh, it depends on which home. Okay. So one home we're two and a half hours, another home we're nine and a half hours. Gotcha, yeah. So it oh, just man. depends on which one. Yeah, I got you. No, that's cool. That's awesome. Uh, y'all definitely showed out last week with Bodie Jr. They definitely and, did. And Brandon James, y'all. Yeah. That was did super awesome. Well, man. So yeah, super proud I need to guys. build on that this week for Absolutely. sure. Absolutely. Yeah. So they're our front runners right now, man. They're yeah. doing well. Their program's working good for them. Uh, unfortunately, our program's struggling a little bit. We just embrace the suck, man. We just try to push through and figure things out as we go along. Yeah, that's, that's right. kind of part well, of it. As long as you're continuing to grow that's and it. Uh, get faster every pass. Every pass, man. Yeah. That's cool, man. Every pass, man. Hey, well, it's thanks. good to see thanks you out here, Thanks for talking. Man. Yeah, of for course, sure. Man. Thank you very much. All right, brother. Yep. Good luck. Awesome catching up with James and his wife Stephanie. They are awesome people. He has been out testing this Camaro twin turbo powered. Like 
James said they got the whole Team Cali out here this week. Gucci is back out here, but not with Bodie behind the wheel. This time it's Giuseppe Gentile. We need to build a lot faster, didn't it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we need to get engaged. What's up, Giuseppe? How's it going, man? Good. Engaged, we can check all the pressure. Here is Team Texas member James Birdman Finney. I seen him make a couple passes last week, y'all. He was rolling. Uh, ended up coming up a little bit short to Disco Dean. First round last week at Firebird. But uh, we'll see how he can do this week in Tucson. Right next door here, we have his teammate, Mike Marillo. LaFonda. What's up, Corey? What's going on, brother? How are you doing, man? Good, man. How are you doing? Good to see you. Oh, yeah. Y'all ready for this weekend? Yes, sir. Yeah. Oh, for sure. Here's Joe Minton's Novocaine, driven by none other, Tony McKinney. Screw blower. Ginormous. This car is fast. Uh, last week in uh, Firebird, keep forgetting where we're at, y'all. Starting a, a, a long stint here of races. I'm already getting confused on, on where we're at. Um, but let's see. Tony came up just a hair short on uh, Murder Nova last week in round one. It was an awesome race. So we'll see if he can improve this week. Disco Dean on this beautiful brand new pink caddy screw blower combination. Currently 10th in points, 20 points out of the grade 80s, knocking on the door. Uh, he can put one of these races together. He's got an awesome shot of getting back to the grade 8 um, last week in Idaho. Let's see, I'm looking at my list here. He went out in the second round to Brandon James. On to the 405, here is Joe Woods, Dominator. Beautiful dart. He's had some ups and downs this year. Had a couple breakthrough weekends. Last week went out, first round versus Jay Bodie. Yeah, I did. <laughs> Tell us about it, Joe. Oh, it sucked. I didn't have any uh, <laughs> downforce on the back. Dang it. So, we put a wicker bill on this one. Gotcha. It had a half an inch. Okay. Only it compresses an inch and a quarter below ride height mm -hmm. at two seconds out. And we got down to ride height about three seconds out. So, it's just too late. That. Yeah. yeah, way too late. Yep. Yeah, I mean, they're not slow. Yeah. There's nobody out here that's slow. Yep, that's for sure. You got the full two inches on there now, don't you? Yep. <laughs> Heck I yeah. That's awesome. That <laughs> cool, man. Good luck this weekend. Here's Chuck Seitzinger in Second Amendment. Last week went out second round versus Justin Swanstrom. He, he gave him a fight. That's for sure. Currently 17th place, 70 points back of the grade eight. Anything can happen in drag racing, y'all. He puts, uh, puts a couple good races together. He can be right in that grade eight mix, this twin turbo 481X combination. Here is Sean Ellington in the Murder Nova. Had an awesome weekend last week. Made it to the third round. Uh, unfortunately, he drew his teammate, Ryan Martin. Uh, they had a pedal fest for, for that race. It was wild. Y'all need to check it out. Sean is currently...
19th. 19th and 80 points back of that grade eight. Let's see how they can do this weekend in Tucson. Here is Doc. Doc Love in heavy metal. The guys getting getting this car ready. Got the fans going. It's hot out here, y'all. Right next door, we got teammate Jerry Monza Johnston. Beautiful split bumper. I know he's anxiously awaiting his new car. Sounds like it's probably going to be next year when it comes out, but it is going to be a bad one. See how these guys can do in this elevation out here in Tucson. It's Team Detroit. John Odom. Odom Racing. Jim Howe. Howe Motorsports. Uh, see how these guys did last week. Pulling out my list. Well, y'all take a look at these beautiful brand new cars from this year. Jim Howe went to the third round, went out versus your semifinalist, Brandon James. Um, and John Odom went out second round versus Kayla Morton. These guys came out and have been making a statement with these screw blown combinations. Steven Brindle and the brand new Game Changer Mustang. Pro Charge Hemi. Get into Team Nola here. Uh, looks like nobody's around here currently. Uh, David Gates Pit. I think y'all are excited about this one. I am as well. Bobby Ducati has not unveiled his new car yet. We'll see what that is later on. Uh, been to Jerry Bird's Pit. Been to Scott Taylor. Lizzie Musi, Kai Kelly. Let's hop over on the other side. See who we got over there. Looks like we got Callie Mills. Team Swan Gang. Stopped by and seen high velocity already. Y'all know the situation there for tonight's grade eight. We got Larry Larson in the new gray wrapped X Insurance Defco trucks. Caddy. All right, guys. Here's a here's a surprise, familiar face here. Kelly Blue Ball. Looks like he's out here in a new ride. Got the Judge out here. This thing is pretty.
Here's Chuck 55. He had a close race last week. With Scott Taylor in the second round. He's got this screw bone combination figured out. This 55, nobody wants to draw this car. Here we are, Team South. Wrapping things up here, y'all. Thank you for watching. We got Cody Baker, Shake and Bake, his roots blower. Next door, we got Kayla Morton. Must have been uh, Team South draw Scott Taylor weekend. Uh, Kayla put up a really good run against Scott in the third round. Kayla's currently 15th in points. And 50 points back. Grade 8. We got Sean Wilhoyt and the mistress is currently 17th in points it's like 70 points back of the grade 8 this car has been rolling John went out second round versus murder nova last week firebird Got Brody Melton, Big Booty Judy. Congratulations to this team. Had a long run in the futures and has earned their spot here in the Invitational. Congratulations to them. They had an awesome first run, close race last weekend um, in that first round versus Kayla Morton. Just came up a little bit short. We'll see how they can do this week. All right, guys, that's gonna wrap up your Tucson pit tour. Thank y'all so much for watching. I uh, apologize for last week, not getting to the pit tour, but it was awesome getting back around, seeing all these awesome cars, showing y'all what's going on. It is getting a little bit more cloudy here. The wind is picking up telling y'all we're bound to get some weather but just hold tight with us we will get y'all the racing results as soon as we possibly can thank y'all again please like subscribe burrowmax.com if y'all need a pit bike we got the 750s here and the 1600s they got smaller versions as well y'all check out burrowmax.com thanks for watching y'all